Hey guys, what is up and I welcome each and every one of you to a new League of Legends video. This is going to be a relatively quick one, but guys, ladies and gentlemen, the new champion, Aphelios, has been revealed. This is pretty much out of nowhere, which is why I'm kind of late with this video. I was, I mean, I was honestly sleeping because, you know, I was playing a lot of League of Legends, but out of literally nowhere, I mean, we're just figuring out how to play Santa still and Builder and all that stuff, and Riot is just like, yeah, here's another champion, Enjoy. Now, the abilities aren't out just yet, but this is the splasher for Aphelios. His the full name is Aphelios, the Weapon of the Faithful. Now, they did, however, reveal this page over here, which is kind of like a lore page. Well, not kind of. It literally is a, a lore page uh, of Aphelios, the Weapon of the Faithful, right? So let's go over this page together. We'll read it together. We'll go over a little bit of uh, other information and... That's pretty much all we have so far. Now, the champion, if you're aware, or not aware, rather, is from Failure, or not Failure, so Targon, which is where uh, these two guys are from, uh, Diana and Leona, and of course, I think Pantheon. I don't know if Pantheon is still technically from it with his new lore. He's, like, related to Targon. Uh, it doesn't be another marksman, which is very surprising, because, I mean, we literally just got Senna. Senna is, she's a marksman. She's a marksman support, which, now we're getting another marksman, literally right after Senna, which... It's just a little bit weird timing, I'll be honest. It just kind of came out of nowhere. But anyways, let's take a look at what this says. Emerging from Moonlight Shadow with weapons drawn, Aphelios kills the enemies of his faith in a brooding slice. Brooding slice. You can see he kind of has like a like a little half-sickle thingy almost, right? Which is actually pretty cool. Not sure how that's going to work. Maybe he throws like a ghost sickle when he attacks. I don't know. Um, speaking only through the certainty of his aim and firing... Dude, I have like a thing over my like a eyelash something. Uh, and firing uh, off... Firing of each gun. Though fueled by a poison that renders him me Oh, he's Mio, so he's like Sona. He is guided by his sister Alun in her distant temple sanctuary from where he pushes an arsenal of moonstone weapons into his hands. For as long as the moon shines overhead, Aphelios will never be alone. So that's obviously his sister. That's a pretty interesting concept. So it's kind of like a Sona... Male Sona, if you will, which uh, is going to be really, really cool. Now, if you guys uh, forgot or you know weren't aware, this was... Or the champion, rather, was teased in this champion roadmap that was in October. The faithful shall be rewarded. Let's go over it one more time very quickly, just to kind of refresh ourselves, you know, maybe it'll give us some new information. What will you sacrifice for your faith? Only the devout will master the next champion we have prepared for you, a new marksman, raised since birth with only one purpose, to protect the faith from those who stand in the sun. So does it mean he's allied with Leona? I don't know. Uh, constantly training, mastering diverse weapons of faith, swapping them through, uh, swapping through them like cycles of the moon with a nothing but that one lone of voice. Pushing, comforting, loving, which is a sister, of course, now we know. If you're up for the challenge, you too must train hard and achieve zen like focus in order to reap the rewards. So I ask again, what will we stack? Oh, by the way, guys, if you're not aware, if you're not aware, this is big information. This is the champion that is created by uh, Certainly T and Stashu. Now, Certainly T, and that is... That is a designer right there, ladies and gentlemen. That is the guy that made Yasuo. That is the guy that made Zoe. That is the guy that reworked Akali. That is the guy that makes the champions that are, I mean, I'll be honest, very fun to play. But my goodness, do they make you want to just, ah, uh, you know, when you're facing them. And it's just, it's no, no, no bueno, man. No bueno. Seriously, no bueno at all. So, yeah, there you guys have a nice quick little video giving you guys a little bit of an update on Aphelios. Apologies for it being late. I was sleeping. I did not expect this to come out, I'll be honest. But uh, here it is. Hope you enjoyed it. If uh, you're excited, don't forget to hit that like button. I'll be making more videos when there's more information, such as abilities, gameplay especially. And uh, until then, guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.